Hey guys, welcome back. So in the last video, we created a the authentication for our web application. In this one, we're gonna look at um, creating roles. So as you can see here, I already saved it and it doesn't let me delete it, but usually when you get your application, you get it like this with empty app roles. So what I've done is I added a role um, for users. In this free text, I just admins can manage roles, perform all task actions, just random string, uh, unique ID, and then you have to do admin, well, I called it admin, and the value that I set is admin. So whenever I code anything, the role name is gonna be admin, that's what shows up in the claims. So um, now that we have added that, we have to have users that are admins. So we're gonna go to enterprise applications, um, my application. We're gonna go in users and groups. And here we're gonna add, if we had more roles, it would show this is not grayed out, but right now we only have admin. So we're gonna add the me at Coding Flamingo as the admin, and we're gonna leave the other user as regular. So now we're gonna go back to our code and we're gonna um, add some stuff in the layout to make it different for admin. So it can be done for either showing more buttons. So in this case, we're gonna hide a button or actually let's do another one. So we're gonna do this and instead of home, let's call it admin. And here you could go to an admin tab that we don't have right now. Um, and then we're going to do in the welcome, so in the index, we're going to change instead of just saying welcome, so we know whether or not you're an admin, we're going to do, if the user is authenticated and the user has a role named admin, then say welcome admin. If not, you just say welcome user. And you could have this with many roles as well. Uh, so now let's test it out. And so we come into the application, it gives me two options because I have both of them logged in. So let's try the admin experience first. As you can see here, um, it says welcome admin, and I have the extra admin tab. So if we, so we do sign out, now we're gonna sign in with the regular user. It says welcome user and there is no admin tab. All right, so this was roles for uh, web applications. I mean, the next time we're gonna look at also limiting the API. So even if you get around the UI, we'll, we'll get through the API. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.